So watch the difference between me picking up her front leg compared to me picking up her back leg. See how nice that is? Watch the back leg. Totally ignoring me. So what's going on is she's already been taught how to pick up her all four of her feet. I did last summer. But since this is our first winter time, I haven't been handling uh, her feet as much. I do handle all my horse's feet, you know, pretty much at least once a week, clean them out, give them thrush treatments, uh, just maintaining them. But now she needs a trim and the farrier is not going to be very happy. <laughs> so I need to fix this. And if I would have corrected her when she first started getting resistant with her back legs, it would have been an easy fix. But since I let it progressively get worse, 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 well, now my work's cut out for me. So how I'm going to fix this is what I'm going to do is use the concept of make the right thing easy, the wrong thing hard. Because if this was about teaching her to pick up her back leg, I'd be doing something totally different. So I'm going to ask, run my hand down, tell her I'm coming. Grab her fetlock because she's been taught that she feels pressure on her fetlock. She's supposed to pick it up. She's ignoring me. So I'm going to ask her to move her feet. And it doesn't matter what exercise, just move her feet. So I'm going to disengage, ask her to back up, back up, back up. Disengage, disengage, disengage. It's all about moving their feet. Make the right thing easy, the wrong thing hard. Because she already knows, she already knows how to pick up her back legs. So let's ask her again. Start from the top. Ask her. Tell her I'm coming. Much better. So I quit her before she quit me. So she did put her foot back down, but I let go before she quit me. So sometimes you just need a starting point. So I'm gonna ask her again, run my hand down, grab her fetlock, pressure, 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 pressure. Ignored me, see? Just a lack of respect, that's all it is. Move her feet, move her feet. So I don't wanna be too assertive because of the snow and ice. So I'm just gonna kinda switch it up. Disengage, backing up. Ask her to move her butt. Move her feet, move her feet. So she'll learn that if she don't pick up her back legs that she's gonna have to move her feet. So, one, two, three. See how she's not shifting her weight? I'm gonna have her shift her weight. Pressure, pressure, pressure. So she just, she's already been taught all this. So I'm gonna ask her to move her feet. Disengage, disengage. Now I'm gonna ask her to back it up. Back it up, back it up. Back her up. Make the right thing easy, wrong thing hard. Ask her again. So there she goes. I would like her to shift her weight. Grab her fetlock. I'll give her one more chance. Pressure, pressure. Good. I'll give her that. So, I mean, that wasn't pretty, and that wasn't really willing, but that was an improvement, and I'll give her that. I'll reward her for that. So I'm teaching her that if you give me your foot willingly, then we don't have to move around, move your, move your butt. So start from the top, let her know I'm coming, work my way down, grab her fetlock, one, two, three, there she goes. So she slammed it down, move your butt. Butt. So I, I would like to be a little more assertive, but with the snow and ice, so I don't want her slipping. So we'll just move around a little bit, back it up. Nope, she's being resistant right there. Back it up. There she goes. Back it up. Move your butt. Move your butt. Move. So she's not taking me serious. She's not respecting my leadership. So ask her again. Run my hand down. Grab her fetlock. One, two, three. Totally ignored me. Move your butt. Move your butt. Move your butt. So it's just about moving their feet. Move, move, move. Make the right thing easy, the wrong thing hard. 
Move your butt. Move your butt. That's why I like to try to switch it up a little bit because I can't be too assertive. So I like to switch it up a little bit. Task again. Tell her I'm coming. One, two, three. Totally ignored me. See how she's just looking off the other way? She's not too, too concerned. Totally ignored that pressure. Just move it. Move it. So she's licking and chewing. That's a good sign. I like that. I'm going to ask her to back up. Back up. Back up. Back it up. So if I would have, as soon as she started getting, res, you know, resistant on that back leg, if I would have corrected it right away, it would have been a, look at that. Good, I'll give her that. Much better. Much better. So, you know, this is why it takes a little bit longer because I just let it go too far.